Welcome to another installment of Property Vlogs. Today we are in Upton Gardens to show you this two bedroom apartment. It's by Barrett London and all the details are going to be in the description. But a quick snapshot of what you're about to see. Like I said, it's two bedroom. The size of the apartment is 760 square feet and it's currently on sale for close to £480,000. If any of that sound interesting or picked your interest, stay tuned and we'll tour the whole thing together. Okay, so coming in, the first thing you're going to notice is this lovely wood grain effect to the flooring in a neutral tone. It is a luxury vinyl flooring and then that's paired really nicely with the door which is in a walnut effect and then the storage and cupboard doors in the apartment done in a white painted or white veneer wood grain effect. Inside there is the clerk room. I'll just give you a little peek. So it's a lovely position for obviously like a boot room slash cloak room, really well positioned by the front door. You've got a little area here for the console and a large mirror or art piece. And then we come straight off the corridor into our first bedroom. You've got the ensuite in there. The ensuite is a fully tiled shower enclosure with a thermostatic shower and then a monochromatic take on the color scheme as well with really dark kind of veneer on the surface on the worktops paired with bright white white contrasting colours as well. You've got a grower faceplate, you've got a little bit of a recessed shelf there for like toiletries which is great for storage and small spaces and then you've got your wall-to-wall -wall, um, mirror there as well, shaver socket and a heater towel rail behind the door. So coming back into this bedroom you've got carpeted flooring and then you've got a fitted wardrobe to here and a little space here for a little nook um it's up to you what you want to make i reckon you could probably extend the wardrobes if you wanted or maybe have this as like a little dressing area as they've done that's lovely i love the bed it's it looks like it's a double sized bed with two bedsides and then behind the floor to ceiling curtains are the um, a full height uh, window there and I love the wallpaper they've done in the show home and it's kind of helped kind of define the feature wall in this room as being this wall where your bed goes so coming back into the corridor our mystery door we know it's a mystery door because it's very skinny what's going to be inside of it it is our services so you've got your meters which is great it means you don't have to go outside to check your meters you can do it all in the comfort of your own home so coming around here brian if i just scoot over here i'm going to show you what's behind these white veneer doors the first one has it's a store cupboard and as you can see inside we've got our venting uh, mechanical ventilation system and services and then the next one is our washing machine by Zanussi and hot water cylinder which is where all the water and the heat in this whole apartment is being powered lovely so coming further down we've already discovered there's um what's the word central heating to the apartment there's a radiator here and a thermostat and then let's come and i will show you this as well so this is our main bathroom again the proportions are very nice to this space this is very similar to the ensuite so that says a lot about the principal bedroom over there so you can see the size the bath is a nice sizable uh it's a sizable size you've got your heated towel rail your, your glass dividing screen and shower over bath over here and then again a similar vibe when it comes to the sink and the hidden system toilet and i like the fact that they've done a um, shaver socket recessed into the bathroom cabinet as well lovely and it's mirrored as well so it's it's dual function and then we're coming back into this space and guys this is our show home tour don't you just love what they've done with that artwork? These are all the local um, features. So we've obviously got a stadium. We've got Westfield Shopping Centre, um, which is just, you know, a train, a 10 minute train ride from here. And then we've also got um, Canary Wharf here as well. Columbia Road, Spitterfields. These are all accessible within this area. And let's look at the next room. So this next room is the second bedroom. This room is again a double. So you do have to walk a little bit to come into it. Again, it's carpeted. You've got the wooden um, veneer and the quality of these um, wardrobes is fantastic as well with the sliding doors. Let's have a look. Yep, 
uh, floor to ceiling, a little desk here, work from home area if you're tight for space or a dressing area or a reading area. You've got your floor to ceiling window there with these beautiful curtains and then you've got another unit over there as well and then paired with these gorgeous floor to ceiling drapes on the outside which is really lovely. The interior design is fantastic. Um, the bed itself is a king size bed as well, just note that, so it's not too small and it's nice and roomy. And then we've got a really lovely leather headboard, which I'm just going to pinch in a second. Lovely, nice touch to it. Beautiful woven wall here. It's a nice feature. Again, in show homes, they do have a way of just kind of helping you to imagine how you'd use a space. With that being said, let's come into the feature space and the feature part of the home is the open plan living kitchen dining space. <clears throat> so coming around here, if I just walk to the back as I always like to do, you can see this apartment has a dual aspect and it's at the corners as well, which means you're going to have lots of light and lots of just um, views out of the apartment we're obviously on the ground floor but imagine further up you'd have even better views of the apartment you've got the dining nook here which has been accented accentuated with this beautiful uh, pendant lighting feature kind of a semi chandelier i love the copper tones on the lighting feature you've got a floor standing light as well in the corner and then you've got these huge um, full height windows and the bottom panes are actually fixed and the top panes are opening so you can potentially open them completely wide open during the hot summer months while still having privacy and security in the bottom panes got windows over there and then you've got because this is the ground floor apartment you've got access to your own private terrace but remember there's also a private um terror um, balconies on the higher up floors and um, now you are just looking at, at the private terrace which has been beautifully landscaped with some minimal and contemporary flower pots as well and it's been paved there's a linear drain there so you're not going to have to be worried about water and then the railings are done in a way to add security but let you look out so they're kind of they've got gaps between the railings love it <clears throat> so um, with that being said, now we are in the open plan living space. It's been staged with a three seater and two, ar two armchairs. This sofa looks super, super comfortable. I love it. So as you're in this space, you obviously, this is your entertainment zone. Your TV could be on that wall. They've made that wall your feature wall, which is why they've put this textured wallpaper again. That seems to be a theme in this apartment as well. And then they've got the lighting, but you could change the aspect depending. If you really wanted, this might be where you put your dining table and that corner could be where you put your living area. Um, it's completely up to you. The next space is this kitchen area and it's an L-shaped kitchen. You've got a kitchen sink here. In my opinion, it would be really cool if there was a window in front of the sink, but you're not lacking of windows because this apartment and this open plan space does have corner to corner glazing. So there are views. We've got a dishwasher as well by Zanussi, as you can see. And the finishing of this kitchen is just fantastic. You've got this laminate worktop in this concrete effect. It's very, very bright as well. And it contrasts really nicely with this very lovely warm, warm gray um, kitchen as well. It's all contemporary and it's all on soft closes. I'm going to show you briefly the storage in the whole kitchen. So you can just see cabinet and doors cutlery drawer on a soft closer there you go cupboards extract fan cupboards Ooh. and more storage you've got sockets as well around the back so you've got a bank of sockets you've got this upstand which is going to make um, which is going to protect the walls as well and that continues behind and forms a splashback. You've got an induction hob, so not a gas one guys, and that's really great. I'm just looking there, so it's a four hob as well. And then instead of having the oven there, we've got it integrated here. This is also your Zanussi oven here, and then you've got your fridge and freezer, which I will show you in a 70-30 arrangement. Lovely! Um, 
again, they've utilized so all the space for storage. And I think that's pretty much the kitchen. I've tried to open the cabinets because we do get comments about people wanting to know how much space there is. As you can see, there's lots of space and it's appropriate for the size of the apartment. So I think that pretty much covers this tour. And I really like being in this space. So I'm just looking where to close my video. Right, let's close it over here. Guys, if you enjoyed what you've seen or you spotted something, write it in the comments below. We'll get back to you, we read all the comments. But most of all, before you disappear, like this video and uh, subscribe so we can see you in our next video and that you get notified. Until then, see you, bye.